This question was asked in the UGC NET examination computer science in June 2014 paper 2. A text is made up of the characters like alpha, beta, gamma, delta and sigma with probabilities like 0 0.12, 0 0.40, 0 0.15, 0 0.08 and 0 0.25 respectively. The optimal coding technique will have the average length of how much okay now we arrange the elements in ascending order according to their probabilities so here we have delta we have delta we have got 0 0.08 then alpha we have got 0 0.12 then gamma 0 0.15 then uh, sigma 0 0.25 and beta with the highest value of 0 0.40 okay now we will add these two least values the smaller values are the least value is this one 0 0.08 and the next higher value is 0 0.12 so we will add these two values okay always try to add the lower value, lowest values first okay so 0 0.08 plus 0 0.12 it creates when added is 0 0.20 and make a round over here because you have derived it okay so from where you have got you have got from 0 0.08 that is like this and 0 0.12 okay so you have created this 0 0.20 now you see that these have been used already so these are left so from here you see that 0 0.15 will be not will not be on the right hand side but it will be on the left hand side because it is lesser than 0 0.20 you have derived already so 0 0.15 comes before 0 0.20 so 0 0.15 here and the next value is as 0.25 is greater than 220 so 0 0.25 and 0 0.40 sorry here it will be 0 0.40 okay so this is your figure a next you can draw here is figure b next will be so you have to consider this value, this value, this one and this one now. So according to this, these are the lowest values, the smaller values are this. So you add this, these two, okay, these two and you will get 0.35. So you will get here like this, the 0 0.35 and from where you have got, you have got from 0 0.15 and on the right hand side you have got from here that is 0 0.20 okay so you have derived also from 0 0.20 you have got it from 0 0.08 and 0 0.12 okay so this is your structure this is called B now so these two you have used so these two are left okay so when these two are left see 0 0.25 where will be 0 0.25 0 0.25 is lesser than 0 0.35 so 0 0.25 will come over here so 0 0.25 will be here then use 0 0.35 and then your 0 0.40 right so this is your figure b now your figure c come to figure c okay so here you will draw Now go to figure C. Now to do the figure C, you consider these two values because this is your figure B, okay, and 
in the figure B you will have these two values are the least values so you add those two values 0.25 and 0.35 and you will get 0 0.60 so draw it like this 0 0.60 and you have got it from 0.25 and on the other hand side you have got it from 0 0.3 5 okay now 0 0.35 you have got from 0 0.15 here and 0 0.20 okay again 0 0.20 has right from 0 0.08 and 0 0.1 okay so you have got like this 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 structure now you have added these two values so the value left or the only value left is 0 0.40 and 0 0.40 is less than 0 0.60 so it will come on the left hand side so 0 0.40 so you've got this okay so name it c so you add these two and you will get one so 1.00 you have got it right this where from you have got? You have got from 0 0.40 on the left hand side and 0 0.60 on the right hand side. Now again 0 0.60 you have got from 0 0.25 on the left hand side and 0 0.35 on the right hand side. left hand side here you will get 0.15 on the right hand side you will get 0 0.20 and finally 0 0.08 on the left hand side and 0 0.12 on the right hand side so this is your figure D so you see the figure now you have to identify the probability values with the characters so 0 0.40 belongs to which uh, character you have to find out so 0 0.40 belongs to beta okay so you see over here that 0 0.40 belongs to beta so make it 0 0.40 equal to beta here beta okay next 0 0.25 0 0.25 belongs to sigma so make it 0.6 this one okay Next 0 0.15, 0 0.15 is gamma. So write here 0 0.15 here, sorry, here is gamma. 0 0.08 delta and 0 0.12 is alpha. Okay. So the path length. So you write like this. So the path length of alpha equal to how much see the figure see the final figure alpha alpha is here and from the root see from the root 1 2 3 4 so to reach alpha you have length 4 so write it here alpha equal to 4 then beta where is beta find out here is beta how much length from root only one so beta becomes one next gamma where is the gamma here gamma is here so find out how much one two and three so gamma will be three okay next delta how much is the delta find out delta where where it is so here is delta here is delta so delta to reach delta you have the path length of 4 see 1 2 3 and 4 so delta will be 4 and sigma how much sigma sigma will be 2 
because sigma is here so from the root 1 2 so sigma is 2 here okay so you have got the path lengths of each of the characters so the optimal path length will be of length of the say for alpha is 4 into its probability that is 0.12 okay so you have got this thing for alpha next for beta it is 1 so 1 into 0 0.40 plus gamma 3 into 0 0.15 plus delta delta is 4 so 4 into 0 0.08 and sigma is 2 into 0 0.25 so if you calculate it you will get 2.15 and there is your answer okay so if you like the video please support me with the like uh, button okay and thank you very much